Welcome back, Spavis. Mr. Z here. And we are back in Breath Edge. And we are ready to go do the pellet thing, I believe. Now, we just came back from the original shuttle. I healed myself up. Um, I tried to make a chair because in the building thing, it said you can sleep in it if you have a good chiropractor, blah, blah, blah. So I thought, hey, it's going to let me, you know, sleep in this chair and then I don't have to uh, mess with the other stuff. I thought, you know, hey, cool, great, awesome. Well, that's not exactly how it worked. Um, in fact, it didn't work at all. Okay. Stop it. Beef pellets loaded. I didn't think that was going to work, but, you know, it's a thing, apparently. Yeah, I, I lowered... think you're almost there. You can probably ignore the cooling gel's slight course deviation and assume that the core's activity is partially reduced. <laughs> oh, we bounced off the stuff. Let me get over here to this light. Actually, I don't even need this light now. Haha. -ha. Back to the station. This is working autonomous oxygen station. Where? Ah, uh, I don't know which one it is. Oh yes, that reminds me. I still need to mess with the uh, the symbols. Know if we're gonna make it. We might end up hurting ourselves again. Come on, you can do it. Turbo boost. Yeah, we're probably gonna take just a little bit of damage. But this is why I went and healed earlier. Just in case. So, anyway, we got the, uh... We got the beef pellets. We sent the thing out. I want to see something real quick. While we're sitting here, um... Electronics, compensators, and generators. Can I build some of this stuff? Where is it? Is it under generators take alkali, electronics, metal, and wire? Actually, I think I can make some of those. Alkali. I can't remember if it's at two electronics or four. So we're going to go ahead and take four. We'll take four of those as well. And I needed, what did I need? I needed a uh, wire, right? I think so. Okay, let's see here. Can we do anything? Resources. Yes. Okay, so let's build a couple generators. We're going to try to see if we can't get this other tank going because I'd really like a little extra oxygen. Okay, so we got two generators. 
I need two compensators. What is a compensator? So I'll need two alkali, two refined metal, and two titanium. Two refined metal, two titanium. That's one compensator. Oh, it's two, two refined per. Ooh, you're kind of expensive. You better be worth it. Well, of course it's worth it. It's extra oxygen. And in space, you can always use extra oxygen. And now I need four electronics, which I don't have. No, I don't. Um... I think we can get them fairly easy, though. Uh, where did my bike go? Why is my bike always gone? There it is. Would you sit on the thing? All right, we're gonna go this way. I know for a fact that there's electronics over here. There's probably electronics in other places too, but I know for a fact they're here. Get us a larger air tank, then we'll be able to do some business. I think air tank, and then we'll try to work on one of the uh, one of the bigger accelerators after that. stock of my oxygen. Let this fill up for a minute. Oh, we're kind of running low on water, aren't we? Uh, let's go ahead and drink. Well, let's go ahead and eat as well. Oh, I need the drill. My bad. That was one electronic. Let's zip over here real quick. It's two electronics. What do we got here? Aluminum? Yeah, we'll need aluminum at some point. Um, I don't think I have enough electronics to... Well, no, we barely have enough, but let me see. I need to build a new drill, too. And I know I've taken, like, all my supplies from over here, so let's see. What does it take? A refined metal. I could technically do that. A battery and thick electrical tape. So, technically, if I were to find a box and beat on it for a minute, I could find some of this stuff. Uh, let me do this, guys, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so after a couple of uh, small, short trips out, I decided it'd probably be easier just to come back here and grab my stuff. So, that is what we're going to do, is we're going to come back over here and grab things, because... Um, I found some resin, and I can make fuel now, so yay. We'll just grab a little bit of that. Now, let's see. What was it that I needed? I needed electrical tape and something else. Hold on. 
Uh, equipment, tools, drill. I need to refine the metal. Which luckily we still have. Okay, we'll make this drill up first. Now that I have my drill, we'll come over here. I will make up my oxygen cylinder, or I'll, we'll research 20 minutes. Wow, I was not expecting it to take 20 minutes. All right, well, that's that's a thing, I guess. Um, <laughs> let's see here. Let's go ahead and make some fuel, I guess. One of my big concerns was how much fuel we've been using. And each time I find a new uh, a new container of resin, it puts me a little bit more at ease knowing that, you know, I have I have a stockpile of it. So, and it always seems to be right about the time that I think that I just can't uh, can't afford to use a whole lot of it. I find some more. Oops, I dropped those, didn't I? Yes, pick that back up. So, either way, we have extra fuel. I'm gonna pop out here and fill up the bike with it. Nice, 86. I don't think we've ever filled the bike up that full. Not that we couldn't, just, you know different things um okay so what does it take for me to do the large can i do more than one thing at a time that's also a thing here uh two titanium and an inductor and a compensator okay we gotta go back here to look an inductor is metal plastic and two wires Okay, got a metal. Two wires. And we got a plastic. And it only needed one, right? See, I'm wondering if I could just skip this and go straight into the jet accelerator. You know what? Let's try. Let's see if it'll work. I don't know... I don't know if the game will let me just like bypass things, but if it will, then why not? Okay, we got two inductors. And then I need four titanium and two compensators. All right, what do I need for a compensator? Alkali, two refined metal, and a titanium, which means in order to build two of those, we're going to have to have four refined metal, which means 16 metal. have 16 metal all right so we'll do that we'll just get all this stuff ready for the next next little video we do that's what we're doing we're preparing uh, <laughs> let's see here okay so I needed Two alkali and two titanium. And then we'll come back here and... Oh, I need two more titanium. Hold on. Actually, I think it's a four. Yep. Oh, we can't do it, so you can only do one at a time. Okay. 
Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and... How much room is in it? I'm gonna store this stuff in here so that I know I know where it's at. Uh, where did I put my waters and stuff over here? No, I want one of the... Yeah, give me my bottles. There we go. Would you quit dropping things? There we go. We got that. Alright, so we have roughly how long? 14 minutes. I'm going to pause it here, guys, and I will bring y'all back in just a bit. Okay, guys. There we are. Complete and 20 minutes for that one. All right. So now we can build this bad boy. Now we can build it. I need, <laughs> I need a compensator, two wires, four plastic, and two tapes. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. What? I need a compensator resources. Compensator, alkali, two refined metal, and a titanium. And I do have one alkali left, yes. Grab that. Oh yeah, we're building the compensator. Hold on. Alright, one compensator. I need two wire, four plastic, and two electrical tape. Two wire, two plastic, and then four electrical tape. Is that what it said? No, two electrical tape, four plastic. Sorry, I got that backwards. Put that back. Come back over here. And here we go. One military oxygen cylinder. Plus 200. Military always use the best equipment for the work, and this oxygen cylinder is no exception. Despite the fact that there is no equipment for pumping air into it, its soft, modern valve will still allow you to fill, fill it with enough air with little effort. Alright, let's see what happens. Go ahead and walk over here and drop that one. Uh, Two hundred and fifty oxygen. That's a lot of oxygen. That's enough oxygen that even without the bike, I could get places. Uh, let's go ahead and let's see here. Give me, give me my water. Give me one of those. All right. I say we save the game and we go look for something since we have some extra oxygen now. Uh, where is my bike? I always there it is. Oh, yeah, hold on. You know, I didn't even bother looking. I always forget. I should have done this earlier. Um, settings. Is there a way? Controls? No. Oh, I'm going to have to go back and look at the comment. Um, yeah, there's supposed to be a way to change my marker somewhere, and I don't remember where it's at. Okay, well, I'll do that later then, because I'm going to have to look that message back up. Because I have forgot. Alright, let's see here. Um, Let's go to this guy.
I wonder if that's the O2 station thing they were talking about earlier. I don't know. We're going this way, though. Okay, it seems like it's inside that, huh? We're gonna do it. We're gonna go between the blades. Probably don't have to. Oh no, it's on this side. Oh, I was gonna go through the blades. I still might go through the blades. <laughs> Let me in. Hey, there's oxygen in here. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, give me all this stuff. Neutralize. Uh, what is that? Such an amateur device can make your hair super voluminous. The disaster probably killed the owner before they completed their pursuit of fashion. Oh, refined metals. Okay, so... I'm gonna go ahead and eat that, and plus 30, yep. Go for it. Yeah, we made it. <laughs> Is that a coffin? That looks like a coffin to me. Opened? Um, I don't remember opening one in there. There's another coffin. It is empty. Couple things I can smack open. Some more stuff I can smack open. I'm not gonna go in there right now. And this led me back over here. Okay, so... All right, so this is like an in-between now. Okay, I'm gonna fill up my oxygen and I'm gonna go straight over there. We're gonna see what is going on with things. Okay, hang on, calm, nope, stop. Let me in. There's nothing I can like scan in here. Light bulb. All right, let's get over here and look again. Oh, we needed explosives for that one lock. I remember now. That's what that one is. But... This leaf. I'm still not sure about the leaf. We're going to go over there. I got the game saved. In fact, I can save it again real quick. So if we get shot by a turret, we get shot by a turret. I don't see... Unless that's what that green thing is. I don't know. 
A turret. Be careful. What a strange place. But maybe we can find something useful here. Is that glass? Oh, yeah, don't don't touch the glass with your hand. That's not a good thing. There's more glass. This may come in handy if you calibrate it correctly. Soil analyzer, huh? Okay, well we have a blueprint for a soil analyzer or something. I don't know. Guns <laughs> Yeah, I think that works for me. Okay, so I'm gonna come fill up my oxygen and then I wanna look at that other thing that we saw while we were coming over here. Um, I will find it in just a second. How far is that? 900 meters? We could go over there. Equipment. Tools. Soil analyzer. Okay. Not sure what we need a soil analyzer for, but alright. Now where is, there's my bike. Oh no, that's a lot further than I thought it was. Let's go to that other one that was like 900 meters away. That one should be within range. Right here. We've never been this far over. We'll see if there's any goodies here. Multiple electromagnetic anomalies detected. There may be some breakdowns in the work of complex equipment in this area, therefore the Red Edge Company assumes no responsibility for the behavior and performance of the funerary spacesuit, although I doubt I may have any problems. Force. This debris clearly doesn't belong to the liner, as it is made without data technologies. If you look at the spaceship's debris in the distance, we can assume that the liner didn't just explode, but it initially crashed into an unknown spherical structure of the debris, which we can see now. Provides this size of design were usually installed in old space stations. It's an extremely unsafe place. I can't even use my main systems, only the built-in processor, which is perfectly protected from power surges, but is not able to count to 10 without errors. This is an energy core of the Breath Edge Company. I don't know who transported such technologies Oops. on the liner and for what purpose it was done, but now it's easy to explain the presence of electromagnetic anomalies. By the way, I don't recommend turning off the active core. It will most likely lead to unpleasant consequences. Uh-huh. Yeah, I don't, I don't know about this one. I do not know about this one, guys, because that's, the radiation's just a little bit high right there. Come by this, take a look though. What's over here? Just things. Can I go in there without getting zapped? I wonder. Energy core. I need to neutralize the core. Well, how do I neutralize the core? Mysterious things. Okay. We 
are learning things. You know what? The space station is actually closer. Let's go back. Alright guys, well I think that's going to do it for today's video. We got a little bit done. We got the military oxygen tank, which is going to let us go like so much further than we have been before. I thought the other tank was good. This one is just like, yeah, we're going to be able to do stuff out here for a minute. Um, we are still working on that compensator bridge. Let's see if it's done real fast. Almost, we got a little bit of time left. But anyway, we'll get that in the next episode, guys. But like I said, that's going to do it for today's video. I do hope everybody has enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. It is an awesome, awesome, awesome way for you to show your support to me, to the channel, to the video, and to the game itself. And as always, feel free to share the video on any social media you're using. And guys, just like to stop, take a moment to thank each and every one of y'all for all of your wonderful, awesome support, all the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared. It is awesome. I do appreciate it. And with that being said, until next time, survivors, keep on surviving. <laughs>